Hey guys, my name is X Factor. Hopefully you're having a great day. And today we're breaking down some tips and tricks on how to deal with airplanes in Battlefield 1. Something a lot of people are ignoring right now. The last patch, the bombers were buffed a little bit against small arms fire, but it's still extremely effective. Now, most pro pilots, they're gonna hawk the AA. They're gonna take several passes, kill whoever's on it, then eventually take it down. And as Battlefield stands right now, it takes a long time for that AA to come back, if ever, if you're playing on operations. But most of the good pilots, most of the aggressive pilots, they pull fighters and attack planes. They're glass cannons, death from above. They can destroy your team, and they're counting on you not paying attention. The best thing you can do is simply dump fire on the attack and the fighter plane. Now, of course, you're going to want to try to rip their wing off, and it doesn't take much to do that. Can't tell you how many times a plane's been flying low, ripped the wing off with even an SMG with just one mag, and they just go crashing into the ground. Because some of these maps, they do have to fly low and aggressive to stay away from the AA on the other points. And this is something that's multiplied on operations. They're very linear maps, and you know it's just gonna be constant straight runs. The good news is it doesn't take a lot of damage to rip the wing off, and of course that alters the way that plane flies. The more damage you do to the wings, the more countering they have to do in the air just to stay straight. Now, then they have to repair to get their plane basically undisabled, if you will. That takes time. If you hit that plane with any single bullet, whether it's an SMG, LMG, medic, weapon, sniper rifle, not only do you do damage to it, it might just be one at max range with the LMG, it might be five or six with the sniper, but they're not repairing anymore. Then there's a small cooldown until they repair again. What's the chance that now, because they've been trying to hold that repair for a couple seconds, that they're in big trouble because their wing is still ripped off? And if you're a sniper, load in some K bullets, go for the shot on the pilot, the gunner, because more than likely if you hit them, you're also gonna hit the plane as well, and the damage stacks. You can do 80 to the pilot and still nine or 10 to the plane as well, depending on what angle you're hitting. And I've done this several times, featured on the channel. The planes had cardboard bottoms. You can actually snipe the pilot or gunner out directly from below. Of course, you damage the plane in that process. So if you do nail the gunner, you're still stacking that damage. But as you can see, one of my primary methods, and again, this is a little tougher on Conquest, because they have more area to move, more freedom, is just grab an LMG. This is the MG-15 suppressed 200 count mag, basically. And the only time I let off is to basically manage the cooldown. Because again, the LMGs primarily get more accurate the longer you hold mouse button one in Battlefield 1. First shot's accurate, second, third, fourth, fifth are not as accurate, then it starts to become accurate again. But when you see these planes strafing, you definitely want to wait until they're making the pass, and then of course they fly over, swing your body around, stay bipoded so you're shooting those lasers across the map, and keep dump trucking the damage. If the plane is pulling out and you've lost your lead, just wiggle it around. Hopefully you land a shot just to disable their repair. Again, you might not kill them, but it's keeping them from repairing. That means that's longer that they have to run around in the air to try to chase that repair. Hopefully you guys found this video helpful. Next time you play some operations, whether it's by yourself or with some friends, try to dump truck the attack planes and the fighter planes. They really are glass cannons, easy to take out, and it's extremely rewarding and very beneficial to your team because you're not getting dump trucked anymore. As always, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out, and we'll see you guys soon.